Hello everyone, this video I will show you our new product and this board called KZ68AP and this board also used by the ESP32 module but this time we have designed for 16 channel PWM output so this board you can use for your LD strip such as RGB LD or RGB WLD strip so you can use this board easily work in home assistant by the ESP home and also this board we have designed this two relay and you can use control relay on and off and also have some digital input uh, for a switch or for a sensor and this board also have include the driver on the PCB board so that you can connect with your LED strip directly okay let's look at this hardware details okay let's look at this case 868AP board uh, you can see here the front of the side and let's look at this the back of the PCB board and here is the relay okay let's look at this front of side you can see here and here you can see we have also used the ESP32 module and this you can see that is for 16 output PWM output that's convert to 0 to 10 voltage so that you can see here have some driver this is driver I see so that you can connect with this terminal with your RGB LD directly so every channel so so that you can see here the input output one output two output three output four so if you have connect with the LD strip RGBW that will be easy so just this is for what for power you can use 12 volt or 24 volt and this just connect to the LED strip directly so this chip uh, every chip that driver 3 ampere so you can drive a 3 ampere LED strip directly I think every channel is 3 ampere is enough so you can see that totally will have 16 channel output and this orange color that is power supply power supply power supply because maybe you have used RGBW so that every four channel of the one you will have a voltage for LD strip so this also can use for LD strip and this is for the power supply and for this board uh, this power supply and this black is ground so this is the power system of this board and here you can also see this uh, download just a function button and this is reset for ESP32 module and this is type C a uh, USB C uh, for USB cable and ESP32 and here you can see this is extend GPIO so if you want to use this free GPIO for your own board or your uh, other functions you can connect with this GPIO pins directly so here I have the VCC uh, 3 volt and the ground and the GPIO 5 and the GPIO uh, 32 and here you can see that is Ethernet uh, this time also support the Ethernet and uh, here you can see that is digital input that is 16 channel digital input and the 2 channel digital input because this 16 channel digital input and used, be used by I2C chip extended the GPIO and here you can see the uh, 17 and 18 in digital input that is connect to this GPIO directly so not passed by, by this I2C chip and here also we can see the IS485 A and B so that for IS485 communication uh, with your uh, own board uh, with other IS485 device and here you can see have some two channel of relay and every channel uh, you can see a uh, come and normal open and normal close uh, so normal open and normal close and normal open and normal close uh, for this every channel of relay so you can uh, use this relay to turn on and turn off uh, just by this terminal so this board uh, will be easy to integrate to home assistant by the ESP home we have 
config the we have prepared the config.yaml file and post it to our form so you just directly to use okay if you want install this board uh, to this shell you can see here that is a plastic shell you can just open this box and you will easily to install this board uh, to this shell and install this cover so that you can easily to install the thing rail yeah, you can see this is the back and this is the left side and this is the right side and here you can see uh, that is installed on the show and you can print uh, of your logo or print of your product name on this side and use this board uh, you can use for sound dimmer and change some motor speed and change the LED strip uh, brightness uh, by this board will be very easy because it's used by the ESP home. Okay, thanks for watching.